Hey everyone, it's Julia. Today's video is a very extensive list of different items that you can get for Christmas or if you wanted to ask for them for Christmas too. This is not my wish list by any means. This is just a list of things that are either intriguing to me or that I already have that I enjoy or just things that I know other people enjoy. So I went to Urban Outfitters, Target, Pinterest, and TikTok and I found a lot of these popular wish list items. So for the last couple days I have been putting together this list of over a hundred items and I didn't want to include things like AirPods and gift cards and things like that because those are things that we all kind of already know about but I wanted to put together a list that might have a few unique items on it. I'm sure you guys have heard of all of these things. So I went ahead and linked everything in the description box for you guys to easily shop. Or even if you don't wanna watch the whole video and you just would rather read the description box, I wanted to make it easy for you guys so you don't have to waste too much time shopping for people. So check the description box. Everything is linked down below. I have my laptop over here with the whole list. So let's get into it. First item is the Ultimate Ears Wonder Boom 2 wireless speaker. And my coworker actually had one of these and the sound quality is amazing. So Costco actually has a two pack for $89 right now. So I actually purchased these yesterday and they are amazing. And they're also waterproof. So you can use them in the shower, which is amazing. Next is this little jewelry stand. I actually need one of these. This particular item is on my wish list. Next, Karina Puma sneakers. These are my favorite, so comfy. You will probably see these next few items on pretty much everyone's gift guide, but of course, Doc Martens. The 2976 Chelsea boots are one of my favorites, and then I also own the 1460 combat boots. Of course, Doc Martens have to be on the list. Next are these Timberland boots. I think they are so cute. They have so many different colors that I love, but I specifically really like the kind of tan color and then the black color. Next are the Adidas Edge Lux 3 sneakers. I have quite a few of these pairs of sneakers. They are super comfortable. I personally wear them for work. Next is Set Active. I don't actually own anything from Set Active, but their sports bra and legging combos are so cute and they also have little sweat sets, so Definitely think that would be a good idea to give somebody. Next are these Sorel wedges. I have a pair of black ones that I got a couple years ago. A ton of people around here own them. They're a very popular shoe around here, but I think they're really comfortable. And specifically if you're gifting for like your mom or your mother-in-law or something like that, I think it would be a great shoe to give them. Next, you can have a gift guide without some socks. These are my personal favorite. I'm wearing a pair right now and they're really inexpensive and cozy socks or socks right a lot of people probably have this next one on their list but an air fryer i have wanted an air fryer for so long but i've just never purchased one for myself so i know you can make a lot of good things with them <laughs> all right you're gonna see this next item on literally everyone's wish list or gift guide but it is a mini fridge for skincare i have one from frigidaire and i bought it at walmart actually it is a little black one and i just have it stored in my bathroom on a little shelf and it has a lot of my skincare items that i like to use in the evenings there are so many different options out there for fridges so i'm gonna link a couple in the description box this is the one that I personally have and I think this one's really cute but a little pricey for what it is. Whatever your price point is, I'm sure there's something out there for you. You could check Amazon as well. Next are these wine glasses. I think they are so sleek and sophisticated. Love them. I think giving a little cheese plate would be something super cute. And then also this book called That Cheese Plate Will Change Your Life. And then you could also give like a little jalapeno pepper jam with it or some honey to go with the gift. Or if you wanted to give some cheeses, I'm sure you could too. A bottle of wine would work well as well. So I think giving like a little gift basket would be fun. Next is this little rainbow over the door hook. Super cute and something a little different. Okay, I wanted to buy one of these for myself when I was at Home Goods the other day. It is this little stuffed animal that you can put the little internal thing into the microwave so it's like warm and cozy. I think something like this for the winter months is always so great. But if you aren't into the whole stuffed animal look, they also have just like the heated neck wraps. I personally really, really like having one. Next is a record player and I purchased one of these for my boyfriend for his birthday. Another thing to gift with this is their favorite records or their favorite albums. You can look for old school ones or even modern ones, which is really nice. Next up, we can't forget the Nintendo Switch. I personally have the Nintendo Switch Lite, so that is what I'm gonna link down below. Of course, with the Nintendo Switch comes the games. Animal Crossing New Horizons is my favorite, and I also like the old school Mario game mashup. Love that one. I'm so happy that they came out with it. Super Mario Sunshine is the best. 
Next is a silk pillowcase. I have one from last Christmas and I love it. You could also give like a silk eye mask or even silk scrunchies. They have a lot of different silk products. Next, towel scrunchies. I think these are awesome. You put them around your wrist when you wash your face and that way your arms don't get soaked with water. I run into this problem every night when I wash my face, so I would really like to either make myself a pair of these or purchase some for myself. All you need is the terry cloth material. Next is the loopy phone case. I actually own one of these and I love my loopy phone case. Next, I think dainty jewelry is something really trendy and nice that you can give for people. A couple brands that come to mind are LJ The Label. My friend Catherine owns this company and the products are so amazing. I own one of her bracelets and I want to purchase one of her necklaces for myself. So I really like her jewelry. And then Ana Luisa, of course, everyone talks about them all the time. The next one is the Little Words Project bracelets. I think these are so cute. They're customizable and then you can also choose ones that are already pre-made, but they're kind of something that's like a twist on the old bracelets that we wore as kids, the late 90s, early 2000s, but more sophisticated and modern with the prettier beads. Another cute little gift idea is the Giving Keys necklace. I got one of these for Christmas last year and I wear it all the time, so it's just a tiny little key. Love it so much. Next item is this little foot spa. So I actually used to own one of these as a kid and my mom would kind of give me like an at-home pedicure and I loved it. Like a little at-home self-care TLC package would be fun to include this in. And then to kind of go with that would be a UV slash LED nail lamp and this could be for people to do their nails at home because they can't go out and do their nails at a normal nail salon. You could also get them some different UV polishes. I know there's a lot that are sold at Ulta. Another kind of self-care product is this facial steamer. I think this would be a great product to do at home. Again, the self-care nights and also this gel eye mask. I think this product sounds so relaxing and cooling. You could put it in your little mini fridge and keep it cool for when you want to use it next. And the next idea is this little lap computer desk. Next idea is puzzles. Specifically, I think this friends one is so cute. Also an idea to go along with giving a puzzle is this little roll-up puzzle mat so it's kind of nice because then you don't have to have your puzzle laying out at all times you can just roll it up and store it when you're not using it the next idea is this little projector and screen if you don't have a tv in your room or if you wanted to use this while you're like camping or something like that I think this is a really fun idea. It would be fun to do like a little movie night with it too. The next item is this Revlon One Step Hair Dryer. I actually own this and I got it at Costco. It is great, I love it. It kind of gives you a little blowout at home. Next are these little jaw clips. I'm actually wearing one in my hair right now. I think it's just a little fun hair accessory. Again, one of those things that you can gift as like a little gift package. <laughs> Next is this stainless steel mug. I would keep my beverage really hot for a really long time. So I personally got mine at Target, but they have them all over and on tons of different websites. Fuzzy slippers. I am obsessed with my fuzzy slippers. I have a pair from American Eagle and they are so comfy, but again, you can get them pretty much anywhere. Next is this tie-dye crew neck. I really like that Urban has these paler colored tie-dye sweatshirts. You could also make it yourself if you wanted to and kind of give a little DIY Christmas gift. Next are beanies. Of course, you can get the Herschel ones or the Carhartt ones, or you could just get a basic one from Target that's $5. I personally own this cream one and I love it. Next idea is a very basic crop top and a lot of like these tank tops, of course, are very nice little basics to have and I always find mine at Princess Polly, so I'll link some down below. Next idea are these North Face mittens. So nice for the winter months and they're really cute. For the fitness lovers in your life, you could do a Lululemon yoga mat. I also really like these Lululemon Align leggings. If you're not looking to purchase something quite that expensive, you could do something like the Airy Play leggings. I know they're very comparable in both the texture as well as the kind of stretch of the legging to the Align leggings. So I'll link those down below and they're equally as flattering. Another idea is the Lulu Align tank. Again, that buttery soft material, super cute. I personally have this one on my Christmas list and it is the Lululemon belt bag. It's just like a little fanny pack, something very basic. Next idea is the TM spin shoes. I personally love to cycle and spin, so I really like the white marble ones, but the black ones are super cute as well. They have a ton of different colors and you also have to purchase cleats for them, just FYI, so I linked those down below as well. But if you have any spin lovers in your life, 
it's a good idea so they don't have to rent their own shoes to go along with that of course if you're working out a lot you're probably gonna have some muscle aches so this massage rollerball is something that i love i have had one of these for so many years and i honestly don't know what i would do without it so highly recommend this another thing that is kind of for post recovery is this recovery muscle massager thing <laughs> I don't know. I have one from Nordic Track that we purchased at Sam's Club, but I'm sure you could get them on Amazon or Walmart even. And it has interchangeable heads, which is really nice. Next idea is an electric toothbrush. I personally love my electric toothbrush. I got one for Christmas last year and I will never go back to a manual toothbrush. If they already have one, you could also get them the little toothbrush heads. Everyone always needs those. Next ideas are kind of some makeup favorites, but the first one is the Thrive Cosmetics Mascara. I think I've been using this for three years now and it is by far my favorite mascara ever. I literally will never switch mascaras. It is my favorite. Another favorite of mine is the Morphe Nude N9 palette. It is so beautiful. I love all of the colors. And for someone who isn't that great at eyeshadow, it is a good starter palette. So it's also inexpensive at Ulta. I also love this Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme Gloss. It is a lip plumping gloss, so it might burn slash sting your lips a little bit for the first few times that you use it, but I love it. You could also gift like favorite hair products. My personal favorite is the Amika Dry Shampoo. I love the smell of it. It is just a great product altogether and it lasts a really long time. Another makeup staple for myself is the Makeup Eraser Cloth. It is basically like a reusable makeup wipe. You just wash it in the washing machine and just keep using it until it fails you, which I've literally had mine for, I think five, I think five years, so. It's been a while. <laughs> a staple that I cannot live without is the Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm. I absolutely love this. It smells so good and it makes my lips feel so smooth. You could also give a little skincare set. My personal favorite is the Ole Henriksen products. I love this little brightening kit. I actually got it for Christmas last year and the products are just so amazing. They do smell like oranges, so if you aren't into that scent, maybe stray away from that, but I personally love Ole Henriksen. I haven't used a product that I don't like from them, so that says a lot. <laughs> Another really good gift is the Loving Tan Self Tan. There are a lot of options out there, but Loving Tan is just my favorite. Another staple is the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. You could give a little kit that has multiple different flavors slash scents so they can kind of choose their favorite. I personally really love just the plain berry one. That one is my favorite, but they are amazing. I use it every night before bed. Another product that you could put in the little mini fridge is a rose quartz roller. These feel so good when they're cool and you use like a little facial oil. Love them. Another idea is a weighted blanket. I know that some people hate these, but some people also might like them, especially if they have issues with feeling anxious, especially with everything going on in the world. Next idea are these Target jogger sweats. I own them in three colors and they are so soft and cozy. I get mine in a size small so they could be a little bit high-waisted. They are a little bit oversized. Next idea is this little cloud neon sign. I would love to have one of these. They are so cute and I think it just adds something fun to a room. Another really random product is this little electric kettle. I got one last year for Christmas and I have been loving using it to make tea. I honestly don't know how I ever lived without one. To go with that, you could also do like a little tea sampler and you could gift them a little mug so they could have like a little tea gift set or you could do coffee if they aren't into tea. My personal favorite coffee brand is the Copper Moon. You can typically find them at TJ Maxx and Home Goods, but I'll link their website down below. Another little random gift is this little label maker. I have been obsessed with labeling random things in my house. I have the most organized pantry because of this. It's really inexpensive and something random that you can give to those type A people in your life. Another personal favorite of mine are these hexagon Ray-Bans. I wear them in pretty much 90% of my photos. Next item is this insulated slim can holder. So it's like a little double walled koozie that you can put your slim cans in. I have used my press seltzers in there and they fit perfectly and this is actually kind of like a knockoff of the Brewmate but it's by Ozark Trail from Walmart and it's like nine dollars maybe from Walmart and it's equally just as good. If you're into name brand, you could do the Brewmate, but the Ozark Trail one is great. I've used it myself. I think this next one is so cute. It is this little acrylic memo board. It's like a dry erase board and you just use a little wet cloth to wipe it off, but I think it's just very sleek and cute. Next idea is this little geode magnet. I'm obsessed with little stone looking things, so 
I really like this one. Another idea are the Bath and Body Works room sprays. They are concentrated, so you don't really need much to fill a room, but I have these all over my apartment. I love the scents. The Tiki Beach one is my favorite, but unfortunately, I think they're sold out of that one. I think these are a great like stocking stuffer or something random to give someone. The next few things are something that I'm obsessed with and that's plants. So you could gift a plant along with a little planter or if you don't wanna purchase a plant for someone, you could get them a gift card to a local nursery. Or if you are daring enough to purchase a plant online, you could shop on something like The Sill. There are a ton of online garden websites, online plant websites. You could take a shot in the dark and attempt to order a plant online. I don't think I would personally do that because I like to be able to kind of select what my plant looks like, but I am obsessed with plants. We all know that. <laughs> Another cute thing would be a little plant propagation vase or the little propagation vials that you can put on the wall. I think that is something so cute and I definitely want to integrate those into my home because my plants go hog wild and they grow like crazy. You could also gift a little plant basket. Next are these crewnecks from Self Cares for Everyone. I think self-care is something that's really important as well as mental health, especially right now when a lot of our holiday plans are going to be altered so much. So I think it's just important to acknowledge that and recognize that people definitely are struggling. Next item is something relevant to the holidays, but it is this macrame ornament. I really like to shop small and handmade, so these little ornaments are so cute. And also you could gift stuff for a person's car. So I really like this little macrame tassel car diffuser. You basically just put essential oil on there and and it just diffuses the scent into your car and this rainbow one is also so cute i know these ones are really popular but just an option for people who are into that kind of boho decor style these car coasters are so cute as well i saw these on tiktok and i really want a pair for myself next item is this little no touch keychain i have one of these and i love mine i use it all the time in my apartment i have always been kind of a germaphobe so to have this is awesome for me. Next is this little self-care reflection journal. So it's basically something that you do in the morning and in the evening. I just think it is something nice to kind of acknowledge and recognize things that have happened throughout your day and to acknowledge your your feelings and your thoughts. I really want to purchase one of these for myself just to get in a little bit of a better headspace and a better mental space. Really random, but this Frigidaire ice maker is something that is awesome. My dad actually has one of these and he uses his all the time, but it makes the cutest little ice cubes. So if you know someone who doesn't have like an ice maker or something, it would be a nice little gift for them or if they have like a camper or a cabin, <laughs> kind of a nice little thing to have. Next is this little portable heater. My apartment can be cold at times, so I like to turn on our little portable heater and sit in front of it or like put it on my feet. So I really like having one of these. So people who live in the Midwest or the really cold states, kind of a nice idea. Of course, to go along with that, you need a little cozy blankie. I personally really like the fuzzy blankets that are at Sam's Club. I have this one and it is the best. It's just the Members Mark brand. I know some people have those really pricey blankets on their wish list, but balling on a budget so i really like the ones from sam's club next idea are these oxo storage containers i actually have these i think they were purchased at sam's club or costco one of the two but they're super nice to organize a pantry with and they keep things airtight so they last a little bit longer than like a traditional storage container for a pantry really random but this little selfie tripod is so fun and i actually have one and it actually makes taking photos so nice because i don't need someone to do it for me so especially if you're alone it would be nice to have this you just use a little bluetooth remote and it takes your photos for you next idea is this patty wax oil diffuser i actually bought one of these yesterday and it smells so good i bought the lemon scent and i love it next is this vanity organizer from target i actually own two of these and they are so nice to have you could also gift this with the little makeup items that i mentioned earlier or even skincare items next of course are graphic tees we all know graphic tees are so popular right now but this rolling stones one is super cute it's from princess polly and the very last item I'm going to mention for today's video are these coasters. So someone I actually personally know makes these and they are such great quality and she can customize them to anything that you would like. All right, that concludes this gift guide. If you guys would like to see another gift guide, maybe catered more to like the males in your life, whether that's your dad, boyfriend, father-in-law, brother, things like that, definitely let me know and I can definitely put together another list. Of course, Christmas is not about giving or receiving. It's about spending time with your loved ones and 
recognizing the things you have in life already but someone did ask me to do this video so i did just want to give this little disclaimer thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to go follow me over on instagram that is all for today's video i will see you guys very soon in a new one mm -hmm.